Greetings from the Erie Coast. This is Mad Shad. Tier Vigi. It's on this Tier's Day. Day of Tier. Tuesday. Yeah. Tier. The God of War. The one headed God. God of Oath and other things. Uh, he stuck his hand in the jaws of a mighty wolf and got it bit off. Look it up. Great story. So they, they could bind the wolf and uh, Tyr put his hand in there to... Tyr also helped to raise Fenrir, uh, the great wolf that would ultimately destroy everything. <clears throat> And uh, Fenrir was was weary about what's going on here. He's like, "Why do you want to put a a a silver thread around my neck? You, of, of course, I'm going to break it. But just in case, one of you puts your hand in my mouth, and you know, as a token of good faith. Even though the gods were trying to trick Fenrir to." Uh, imprison him. Tyr, knowing full well what they were doing, put his hand in the mouth of the great wolf, and well, when the great wolf figured it out that he couldn't escape, he bit off Tyr's hand. Tyr also had a sword. Kind of. Well, he could have had a sword. It's called Tyrfing. A sword that, when drawn, must taste blood. Uh, and would vanquish all foes <laughs> in battle. So, yeah, oddly enough, Tyr used to be in charge of the Asir, uh, and then Odin came along and took over. Which Tyr, Tyr said, okay, fine. So that tells you a little bit about... And there's also a rumor that Tyr was Odin's son, somehow. Of course, Odin being the old father... Uh, okay, but, you know, whatever. Uh, let's talk about the great wolf in Afghanistan. Where we placed Americans into the mouth of that great wolf. And now the great wolf's jaws have shut trapping Americans in Afghanistan. But in this case, the Americans in Afghanistan thought they were going to get out. There was supposed to be a way. A way for them to leave. Such was not the case. I just see the correlation. <laughs> So, story. Hence the story. But there are still Americans trapped in Afghanistan. Every day, never forget. 